Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. You can now make non-Google file types like PDFs, images, and Microsoft Office files available for offline usage when you are using Google Drive on the web online. And Google recently made this available to all workspace tiers, including those who use personal Google accounts as well, where previously you could only make Google's own file types like Docs, Sheets, and Slides available for offline usage in Google Drive on the web. Now, in Google Drive online, you need to first make sure that you have offline enabled. So to do this, we head up to the gear icon and click on settings and just make sure that offline is checked and enabled and then just click on uh, done when you finished. And I, in this example, have got a JPEG image, a Microsoft Word doc and a PDF document to make available offline where previously these had no offline functionality in Google Drive online. So to do this, we just right click and available offline. And when this is made available offline, you will see a little uh, tick check mark next to each file type. And because I'm obviously online at the moment, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go to my Wi-Fi and I'm gonna turn off my Wi-Fi. And then I'm gonna close my browser just to clear the cache so this can be a true representation of uh, being available offline. And then I'm relaunching Google Chrome, which I'm using in this example. And when you are offline, obviously you can only access your drive offline functionality when you have a bookmark saved somewhere in the browser. And I'm gonna click on my bookmark. And this will take a little bit longer to initiate and load when you are offline with no internet connection um, in drive for offline usage and we're almost there and i'm just letting that initiate and there we go we can see that i still have the check mark available next to those uh, files and i can now use those offline now it's important to note though that um, non-google file types like images word docs and pdfs um, that are saved offline will need to be opened using apps that are already installed on your computer if you're trying to access them, access them um, through Drive on the web while offline. So as an example, I'm gonna open my JPEG image and that will use my Photos app in Windows 10 because that's my default image viewer. It'll actually open the app now where I can view that image offline through Google Drive on the web. And if I click on my Microsoft Word doc, now I don't have uh, Microsoft Word installed on this computer. So it'll just bump me straight back to the offline functionality in uh, uh, Google Docs online, but I can still view and edit the document offline. And the same with my PDF uh, document. If I open that, because I don't have, as an example, Acrobat Reader or a PDF viewer on this uh, machine, I use my Google Chrome web browser as my default PDF viewer. It'll just bump me straight back into Google Chrome, but I can still view that offline. So if you have Microsoft Word, it'll open in Microsoft Word. And if you have, as an example, um, Adobe Acrobat, it'll open that PDF in Adobe Acrobat. So I think that's a handy feature that is now available uh, in Google Drive online. And this is currently available for Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. And if you're using a Chromebook, uh, you can open images, PDFs, and you know your Office files um, offline directly through the Chrome browser now as well. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.